Welcome to the video. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use this Dust Hunter Sweeper tool to get BNB for yourself. Now, what is a Sweeper tool? A Sweeper tool is a tool that goes on the BNB Smashing Network, the BSC Scan, the Network Explorer, and searches for lost wallet address that have been forgotten. Some of these wallet address, the owners have lost the private key. Even some of these wallets contain gas fees from other wallets. So there are a lot of BNB that has been left unclaimed by different people across the world. So what this Dust Hunter tool does is that it takes the logs of this wallet and it starts to sweep through them. And any BNB smashing it discovers in your country, in your area, near you, it is going to send everything into your wallet. That is what it does. So in this video, I'm going to be teaching you how to use it to scrap any BNB smart chain around you, maybe it has been forgotten or it is a gas fee. This tool is going to bring all this BNB together into your wallet. So just watch as I do everything. So the first thing you need to do is to come over to the Dust Hunter bot. This bot is like a gateway that will give you access to the Dust Hunter tool. So the link to this bot will be in the description. Just click on the start button right here. So now you are going to get this message that says, welcome to Dust on Tap BNB Smart Chain Wallet Tripper Tools. So here you can see the features. So what you are going to do is to click on Access Wallet. Now this is going to load up for a while if it is your first time because it needs to set up things and it is going to bring you to a place like this. So the first thing you need to do when you get to the, when you open the Dust on Tap tool, is to set your wallet address. So you click on settings because all the BNB that will be swept by this tool, you need to set your wallet address so it will be swept into it. So I will go over to Trust Wallet to copy my wallet address and set it right here. So now I am going to paste my BNB Smart Chain wallet address and I'll click on the Save Changes button. So now it says your wallet has been saved successfully. So any BNB smart chain that I sweep from this tool will be swept directly into my wallet address. So the first thing you want to do is you want to start sweeping. As you can see right here, if you click on start sweeping, I have zero logs. For you to be able to sweep, you need to buy logs. Now, what is this logs? The logs is what contains the details of the private keys of this lost wallet address. So some of this address, some of this BNB smart chain account are empty. Why some just contain a little amount of BNB. So let's say you buy logs and inside the logs, there are little, 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 little amount of BNB. There might actually be huge amount, but most of it are little. So this dust hunter sweeper tool is going to accumulate all the dust BNB and direct them into your wallet address. So to buy logs, I'll just be depositing a little amount of BNB. I'll click on this deposit button right here. The minimum amount of BNB you can deposit is 0 0.04. That is the minimum. But I have more than that because I want to buy a good amount of logs. You can actually start with 0.04. Then once you're able to sweep enough amount of BNB, you buy more. So I come over to my trust wallet and I'm going to send $30 worth of BNB. You can actually send 0.04 if that is what you have. But I have more, that is why I'm sending. And if you have more than this, you can send it. The more logs you buy, the higher chance of you needing more money inside the logs. So I'm going to refresh to, you know, I'm going to wait a while. So as you can see, the deposit is instant. I have successfully deposited 0 0.034 BNB. So the second thing I'm going to do now is I am going to buy dust logs. After I buy these dust logs, I'm going to take it to the terminal here to sweep through it. So I'm going to get the money inside the logs. So I'm going to click on buy logs right here. As you can see, 0 0.001. BNB is equal to 100 logs. So I should be able to buy 3,400 logs. As you can see, 3,400 logs, I'm going to spend 0 .3, 0 0.034 BNB. So the minimum you can deposit and the minimum you can buy is 400 logs, or you can buy more than that. So I'm buying 3,400 logs right now. I click on the buy button. So now it says I have successfully bought 3,400 logs. As you can see right here, my available logs is 3,400. And you can also see right here, total sweeps amount is zero. Total sweep amount is the amount of wallets and the amount of accounts that have been swept through. So now this, now we are going to start sweeping through these wallets. 
as you can see, this is my Trust Wallet account that I uh, set on the Dust Hunter tool. I have $2.9 worth of BNB left in the wallet, so I'm going to be sweeping through it. So we're going to be seeing the amount of BNB I am going to get from the logs. You need to note that there is no exact amount of BNB, but the more logs you have, the, more, the higher chance of like making more money. So I click on Start Sweeping. And I enter the amount of logs I want to sweep through. That is 30,400. Then I click on the start sweeping button. So now it says the sweeper has been initialized successfully. So now it is sweeping through this address. And as you can see right here, this is BNB collected. That is the amount of BNB it is increasing. It is increasing as it is checking through the logs. Any money it meets inside any of these logs, it is actually sweeping it and sending it to my wallet. So it has successfully collected 0.1 BNB now. Remember the amount of BNB I deposited was just about 0.03. So let us see the total amount we are going to collect. Let us wait as it keeps sweeping through. So right below here is your network status. Your network status is being updated constantly. And here is the RPC URL. If you're a developer, you are going to understand what this is. So let us wait for the logs to be swept through. What it is doing right now is that it is sweeping through the wallets. Any BNB it meets on any of the wallets, it is going to transfer it to the wallet address I have set earlier in this video. So it is just a little amount. So let's wait until it is done. So as you can see, it said, so uh, the sweeping has been completed successfully. So now let us wait until, you know, this thing is going to keep showing. Gitamina is going to keep showing as it is sweeping. So now, as you can see right here, I think the amount of BNB collected has stopped increasing. And the am total amount of BNB collected now is 0 0.4258 BNB. So now I'm going to go back into my trust wallet to confirm this amount. As you can see right here, my current balance is now 0 0.429. B and B. I was having about just two point nine dollars before I started the sweeping. Now, to now the sweeper sent a total of zero point four two five six eight B and B. So now you can see my balance has been updated. So now let us go over to the history and see how I received the BNB smart sheet. So as you can see right now, see the way it is sending in the BNB little by little, little by little, little by little. You can also see 10 seats in little by little. So the dust hunter is sending it into my address. Every BNB it gets from any of the accounts, any of the BNB smart chain accounts, it sends it into my wallet little by little. So now the dust hunter too successfully sent me about $374 worth of BNB. Remember I bought logs of $30 worth of BNB and I was able to get 374 so my advice for you now, even if you are buying logs with a little amount like $4, $5 or any amount you want to buy the logs with, immediately you, you know, strip through the logs and you get the money out of the logs. Make sure you deposit back the money and buy like a good amount of logs. So that is what I'm going to do now. I am going to send back, let's say $300 to buy more logs so that I am going to sweep through these logs and make more money. Please note that you can only run this dust on that tool on one phone. You cannot create two accounts on the same phone. If not, it might not work properly. So if you have two devices or your laptop and a phone, then you can open it there to mine separately. So now we're going to reload and I am going to click on the deposit button, copy my address, I'm going to send in about $300 worth of BNB smart chain so that I can use it to buy more logs. So now I have successfully sent about 0 0.34 BNB, which is what $300 into Dust Hunter. Let me reload the page to receive it. So now my balance has been updated and I am going to buy logs. Let's see, I will buy. 
Oh, I'm about to bite Nazi 4,000 logs right now. As you can see, I have successfully bought Nazi 4,000 logs. So what I'm going to do now is I'll click on the start sweeping button, go through the same process. I am very sure if I sweep through these 34,000 logs, the amount of gain bear will make will be very good. So that is all for the video. The link to this dust on tattoo will be in the description of this video. So you can just, I think the minimum amount of DNB you can get posted, you can see it right here. So get into the tool, buy enough logs and start sweeping through it. The more logs you have, the more BNB you are going to get. So just buy as much logs as possible. Remember in this video, I think I bought logs of 30 years the work of BNB. And at the end, I got about 364 years the work of BNB. So that is very, very good. This is almost free money. Do not miss this chance. Make sure you like this video, subscribe to my channel, and share this video to your friends so that I can also benefit from it. Until the next video, guys.